Well, Rob, Chicago police tell me that these three victims were targeted, that four men in two different vehicles came down Oak Street, stopped right here in the middle and started firing. Lights, sirens and crime scene tape taking over one of Chicago's most notable streets. I came to pick up a food here at the Le Colonia. Picked up the food, I was about to go, started my car and next thing I hear poop, 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 poop. I'm like, What's happening? This food delivery driver was picking up an order around 430 when he witnessed two cars stop in the middle of Oak Street. Four men got out and started shooting. Our Zoraida Sambolin was also nearby at the time. It was very rapid fire. There was no um, there was no stop. It just it was it was very, very scary. Word is spreading on social media that the 26 year old man pronounced dead is a well known Chicago rapper. A crowd grew outside Northwestern Hospital where he was taken, but still no official confirmation on his identity. A 36 year old man and 26 year old woman were also shot and are in serious condition. What I saw was um, there was a somebody lying that had been shot in between two cars and there were police officers pulling that person up and pulling them out from in between the cars. Police say the suspects sped away on Oak Street headed west. They're looking for a black Ford Taurus and a silver Chrysler 300 M. To see this happen in the in the middle of the day is very, very disturbing. Well, we're going to continue to make good arrests and, and really uh, put pressure on the other parts of the criminal justice system to hold these people accountable. Police will have extra patrols here in the Gold Coast tonight and also near Northwestern Hospital. Detectives tell me they are reviewing security video from all of these shops and restaurants on Oak Street. They are also asking for witnesses, anyone with information, to come forward. We're live in the Gold Coast tonight. Lexi Suter, NBC5 News. Lexi, thank you.